Do you have any idea how insignificant a human being is in compared to, well, everything? Well, I do, because I'm a pessimist and think that way all the time. But if you are not familiar with how just tiny we are as a species, how would you go and take a look at the scale of the universe, too? This is a game that, that puts to light how how big or small things are in the real in the real world this is a game that is more of an information dump where it teaches you so much and it's actually kind of fascinating how some of these things are i i really i really like this i really like this game it is a very very go-to for like little fact tidbits. For instance, the Rafelsia, if we click on that, we can see that it is the largest single flower in the world and can weigh up to 10 kilograms. This is obviously made by English people, so no uh, inches or feet here, but oh well, uh, which is actually pretty heavy. The flower smells like rotting flesh to attract flies which it pollinates, which it uses to pollinate. It's the corpse flower. Click again, and the little information goes away. Now, we're right now at human size, as to scale with the bathroom attendee person right there. Uh, but, but, we can go a little bit, well, bigger, or smaller. There is a uh, there is a sliding scale that accompanies this game. That if you take it, and it's not being shown here because I've been stupid, but fuck it, it it's a sliding scale. It doesn't really matter. Uh, we take it and we go le left. We go in zooming. We see a hummingbird. <gasps> Hummingbirds flap their wings 12 to 80 times per second which is about the same frequency as the lowest notes on a piano. So they're baritones? Hmm. We can go right... and go really big, which I wanted to point this out right here. A Japanese spider crab is almost as big as a... if not bigger than a human. That is terrifying. That That is... that is terrifying. I actually like going and seeing the bigger things out in this. Look, we got an oak tree. That's a big oak tree. This is an oak tree. They can live a very long time. I mean, not as long as a redwood, but eh, nothing really lives as long as a redwood. Oak trees produce thousands of acorns a year. I should know. I live, like, like next to seven of them. It's terrible. Let's go even bigger. We got a Boeing. Oh, look, see, there's the redwood. Redwoods are the tallest trees in the world. Its height's even greater than a human's. Oh, uh, its height's combined. And with an ant is greater than an... I don't understand that reference, or what is it? Uh, ooh, an ISIS satellite. Uh, the Titanic, the ever non sinkable one, that is. Uh, just keep going bigger and bigger. Angel Falls, Mount Yuri. I don't know what that is. What is that? Uh, Cruithene is known as Earth's second... We have a second moon. It actually isn't Earth's moon. It just follows an ecliptional orbit around the sun that is near Earth's orbit. And its year is 364 days close to Earth. Huh. See, I didn't know that. That's actually really cool. And then there's Central Park. Oh god, Central Park. Central Park is the New York City is the most visited urban park in the United States. Did you know that 18 people actually live in Central Park? They're all homeless. Actually, there's probably more homeless, but, you know, those 18 are the only ones that 
have area codes. Ooh, look! It's Rhode Island. So we're now going a little bit big and getting into planetary size here. Ooh, it Italy. I was going to say Italy. Uh, Italy and California. We're on the same size. Interesting. Now we're just going into planets here, though. Look, there's the Earth. Look how insignificant we are to the Earth. We just scaled all the way back. All the way back. Let's zoom. Well, back down here to uh, the hummingbird size. And go, uh, go and check out what's smaller. It's a glass marble. <gasps> glass marbles are round, but they're actually quite rough if you look at them under a microscope. Yeah, nothing. A glass marble is not smooth at all. It just looks smooth to the touch and eyesight. It's very interesting. This is, this is a very interesting game. That's a giant ant. Yeah, no, this is this is a very interesting, well, again, air quotes, game. Because it's not really a game, it's just information. And we all like learning bits and pieces of information sometimes. So, you know, if you want to, you know, stump your friends in a bar, uh, bar quiz or whatever, uh, go check this thing out. The link to it will be in the description below. And being that this is Scale of the Universe 2, there is a Scale of the Universe 1 that has a, a, a varied of different things. But this one, I think, is the one that, I don't know, has more in it. So if you go through this and then see... Ooh, look, it's the Mickey Mouse molecule. Uh, if you go through this, see all the kind of things you've seen, but still want to see a couple other weird shit, uh, go check out the first one as well. The link to this game is in the description below. My name has been Dark Arts, and uh, like I just said, it's the Mickey Mouse Molecule! Ha ha! Ha I'm a water molecule! Ha ha! Water molecules. Uh, I like to think that whenever I drink water, I drink Mickey Mouse's head. I'll be honest, I did not click on the uh, the information when I made up that joke before I started this video. That's funny. That's that's quite funny. <laughs>